everyone, so this is a vlog of me decorating my best friend's very expensive birthday locker. So this will be a vlog because I'm going to take you along with me through the process. It's about a week before my friend Ashley from school, 18th birthday, and basically for the past seven years we both had a tradition that we decorate each other's lockers on our birthdays and it's like over the top. Middle school wasn't as big of a deal, but in high school no one does it anymore so it's just us two. It's on her birthday which is March 10th, so this is going to be up way after her birthday by the way. But her birthday's on March 10th which is a Saturday this year so I'm going to be decorating it the Monday after because I'm actually away on that Friday. And it's gonna be super big, lots of money is gonna be spent, so don't judge that, it's just your tradition. And it's the last one, so I'm gonna go over the top full out, that's why I'm vlogging it. I'm actually about to head to Party City and I'm going to raid the store of all the 18th birthday supplies. I've never vlogged like in a store, so I don't know how much I'm gonna do in the store, I'll see. If not, I'll just like show you what I got afterwards. So I'm gonna start heading up to Party City. I hope you enjoy this whole vlog of the whole process of the locker and you'll like see it at the end and everything. So yeah, stick around. So I'm back from Party City. I didn't vlog too much in there because it was slightly awkward and I just didn't. So I'll show you a few clips of like just the store and stuff. But basically I'm really pissed off because usually every year they have like, if it's a mouse number, they like 16, 21, 30, 40, whatever. They'll have a special section for that age. And they've had one for 18 every year and I walk in and the 18 section's gone. And that's what I was planning on doing. And so I go over and they're like, no, we don't have it anymore in the store. So I was like, no. So what I did instead is I bought all the basic supplies I needed, like um, wallpaper, boa, necklaces, candy, all that stuff, which is in these bags. So all of that stuff is in here. Ignore like my clothes. This is on my bed. But like I bought wallpaper, which I want to go and try to see if I can find 18th birthday wallpaper. In this bag over here, I have a boa, a crown. I bought 18th Sour Patch because I'm basically going to be doing this like scavenger thing for her where each class she goes to in the day is going to have a different note with 18 different different things so like the first class will have 18 sour patch the next class will have 18 brownies the next class will have 18 cookies the class after that will have 18 dollars worth of health nut salad and then the last one will be 18 photos of us that's what i planned out so the 18 sour patch is part of that so that's why there's 18 sour patch so i have some confetti in this one there's just a lot of stuff like a crown over here is a jumbo birthday card candles um this is a happy birthday banner pink jelly beans i have necklaces and this third bag is just all candy. Um, I try to stick to mainly gold, silver, pinks, and reds. So at Party City, I ended up spending $131. I got a $25 off coupon, which was nice. And this is clearly a long list of things. And I don't want it to be about the money. I'm not trying to spend a lot of money. It's just, it's the 18th birthday, this last one. So that's why it's really full out. Um, but yeah, so Party City, that was the basics. Now I'm about to go on Amazon because I'm freaking out because they didn't have all the 18th birthday stuff I thought they were going to. So I'm gonna go order that on Prime. Oh, I'm so mad. So I found this super cute 18th birthday pinata. And it's the only one I could find on Amazon. And it won't ship until the actual day I need it. Okay, so I just placed my Amazon order. I basically, I got tape, a lot of tape, a birthday crown, and some stickers for the outside of her locker. Amazon, honestly, was pretty limited in what they had for 18th birthday. So I couldn't get much. So basically I have all the basics up there. I have like this coming in. Then I have to go to Health Nut. I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow morning. Get a gift card. I have to go to Bristol Farms, get cookies and brownies from there. And then what else do I have to do? I have to print out photos of us, make like the little scavenger hunt thing, go to Susie Cakes to get a cake, go back to Party City Sunday the night before, Sunday night, so I can get the balloons so they don't deflate. And I think that's it. So that is all I'm doing for today for this birthday surprise. So I'll let you know next time I continue to work on this birthday extravaganza. So ignore the look, it is now fast forward to the night of March 11th, that's tonight, and I'm decorating Ashley's locker tomorrow morning. So I'm doing all the prep right now. This is everything laid out, like overall the balloons up there, and like everything scattered, so I have to start putting it into bags and getting all the prep done, all of my scavenger hunt stuff I'm doing done. 
not scavenger hunt, but like classroom things. So that's gonna take a while. I'm starting that now. It's already eight o'clock. So, cause I just came from Adrenaline LA, by the way. I think I'm gonna make a vlog on that. So go check that out. But that's why it's so late. So, we're gonna try to get all this prep done now and I'll keep you updated. Also, I'm annoyed because I was supposed to have an order from Amazon come in and it never made it here on time and it said it would because we have Prime and so now there's some things missing which I had to do some last minute stuff and get that. Also, I went and got a cake from Susie Cakes for tomorrow and they smeared the writing a little bit but it says happy 18th birthday, Ashley. And one of her favorites is chocolate so that's why I got that. So the first piece of the scavenger hunt is done. I have 18 cinnamon rolls in here and there's a little note and this is will be given to her in homeroom for breakfast. Here is number two. It's 18 mini cookies in here. They're just mini chocolate chip cookies. And this is for her double block of comp comparative governments. Okay, so ignore the background noise of the TV for a second, but um, this is treat number three. Basically inside there's 18 bags of Sour Patch Kids for her English class. Here's the fourth one. It's an $18 gift card to Health Nut, one of our favorite salad places. This is the fifth and last treat. Basically there's 18 photos inside this envelope of me and her for her last class of the day. Okay everyone, so this is the final thing. This is the card I wrote her. I had to type it because there's too much writing and I couldn't fit it all. So I typed it and then that's everything. So this is all the stuff waiting to go. I organized it. I took everything out of their plastic wrapping so it's easier in the morning to save time. Also, um, I have another bag full of all the stuff I'm giving to each teacher in the morning. So yeah, basically I'm gonna have to get to school super early, possibly 5 a.m. I'm deciding. Um, but yeah, that's it for her for the night. Now I can finally do my homework. But yeah, I'm all prepped and ready to go for the morning. I will take you with me to school in the morning. I don't know how much I'm gonna vlog because once people start coming, I'm not really supposed to video. So I'm gonna videotape like the process as I'm there because no one will be there clearly at five in the morning. So yeah, I will see you tomorrow. It is 6 a.m. in the morning and we are at school decorating. Actually, don't care. I'm gonna be quiet. But look, this is the start. So this is phase two of the locker. This is the final word. This is now the end. Basically, um, I ended up getting to school around 5.50 a.m. Um, super early and it was daylight savings uh, yesterday, so super dark. But we got to school, I decorated the locker with my mom's help. I'll include clips of that. And then at, she was getting all her gifts throughout all the classes she went to. And then we celebrated at lunch with cake and we lit the candles and she blew them out, which I how to use the lighter which I did without anyone seeing because you can't really have a lighter at school I think but and then we blew out the candles and sang happy birthday and overall it was just a really great day um it was the last locker decoration I'm ever doing which is kind of crazy seven years of locker decorating I think she enjoyed it and it was super fun but basically this video was in case maybe you want to be inspired to do something for your best friend at school and also just share my experience of doing it also this the title of this video is probably something to do with how much I spent on the locker, which yes, I did spend a lot on the locker, but I don't want to emphasize how much it was on the locker because it's more about the memories and um, the friendship than the price tag. Um, but yes, it did cost a lot. Um, I'm not exactly sure how much. I'll leave approximation of how much I figured it out to be by adding everything up somewhere. It is a lot, don't judge, but it's worth it when it means your best friend and sharing memories with them. So anyways, I really hope you enjoyed watching the video, maybe inspired to do something for your best friend. This just shared my little long planning experience of my locker decoration for her. I also gave her her sash and everything, but she didn't want to wear it. So whatever, Ashley.
Please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more videos like this one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!